Welcome back everybody, you're with OG and we're playing Kerbal Space Program 2. Today's mission is to plant a flag in the Mohole. So we're going to be going to Moho. I read in the patch notes that they fixed the bug in the Mohole where there was no collision physics. Unfortunately, I never got to explore that. Uh, some people shot through the mohole and came out at alarming speeds, which looked like a lot of fun. I missed that opportunity, but I am not going to miss the opportunity to go and plant a flag there. So what I'm doing now is just taking a look at moho to see what the gravity is, because I think I'm going to use the rocket that I took to Minmus the other day. All right, the Gravity in Moho is 0 0.275 meters per second per second. And Kerbin should be 1. Alright. And Minmus is 0 0.05. Oh. And the Moon, 0 0.166. Okay, so Moho's got some gravity. I need to be careful. I need to make sure I have enough thrust to weight. I will need to bear that in mind when building my rocket. So what will happen now is we will go to the VAB and I will load the Minmus rocket. Minmus rocket, where are you? And I will then put the landing legs on it, which I forgot to do <laughs> for the last mission. And I uh, will have a look at the thrust to weight and make any other modifications necessary. You will get to see a build montage. I will get to do a lot of hard work. Here goes. All right, everyone. Are we ready for attempt number one? Ooh, who's in the cockpit? Valentina and Bob. Ooh. Let's not do that. I'm just going to take Valentina. And I will do it the way I did the last mission, where I can choose at the last minute if I want to try the RV or not. Because the tin can only has one seat, and if I bring that home, I only bring one Kerbal home. Okay. Val, you are it. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Please excuse the frame rate readout. I'm benchmarking a little. Multitasking. And they say men can't multitask. We have a problem. I can't change direction. 
I don't know if it's just these SRBs that are too powerful for me. I, I can't affect the direction of my rocket at all. Okay. I'm just going to turn the main engine off, shut it down, and ride up on the SRBs until they're out of fuel. And then I will try to adjust direction. That's an interesting one. I, I don't know that I found the problem there. I'm, I'm not sure what's happening. Oh, the gyroscope's changed direction. Alright, I already have a very high apoapsis of over 200 kilometers so I'm going to let this rocket drift up to the 200 kilometer ish area and I will then start my prograde burn up there I mustn't go too high though because I'm on a very steep trajectory and I have very little lateral movement Okay, rocket. Hello, boosters. That's doing it again. Let me. Something is wrong. don't have control I have SAS control but no manual control this is weird I need manual control What if I try to turn on RCS? Well, it would. Oh, RCS. Why? Why the nightmares? Why? don't have time to mess around, I have to burn. I'm going to start falling back towards the planet soon. So I'm going to lock my burn trajectory slightly positive. About there. Well, at least the crossfeed problem seems to be fixed. My stages are not robbing one another of fuel. So that's good. I did see that in the patch notes. And done. We have a good stable orbit. 
but I don't know what's wrong with the controls and this is a problem because if I'm going to descend down a mohole with no manual control I'm going to die so give me a second while I take a look at the control setup Nothing looked out of place. I reset everything, so we'll just hope for the best. Okay, intercept time. Moho is the innermost planet, so we need to burn retrograde, retrograde to Kerbin's orbit. So we need to go that away. That's close enough for now. I can work with that. Then I will sort the intercepting of the planet out once I get closer to its orbit. going so fast but we're going to switch to our much less powerful engine and then it's going to take a long time and a half minutes of burning left to do. Great. Luckily, you can time more burns in KSP2. Ha ha ha. See how we did. Not bad. Let's get out of the Kerbin SOI. Now Moho is at quite an inclination to us. So that's a little bit of a problem, but we will sort that out. All right, Moho is going to be going slower than I am. And so I will let it catch me but I do need to reduce the size of my orbit. 
and I need to level the orbital inclination out. The Moho orbit is also quite irregular. It's, it's rather elliptical as opposed to circular. So I'm correcting for that too. I'll do that burn and then I will correct the inclination at the descending node. Oh, that is bright. That's a little unpleasant. Val, did you bring your sunglasses? Ooh, this is interesting. I'm low on Delta V. Hmm. Bad news, Val. This could be a one-way trip. Or we might not make it at all. <laughs> Oops. You don't even hear this engine burning. Not that you would hear it from outside the craft in space, but you know what I mean. It's weak. Puny engine. Puny. So we're running out of fuel. That makes life interesting. Very interesting. Well, this is a one-way trip. And I don't even know if we're going to make it down to the surface. Someone forgot to pack enough Delta V. Hmm, because someone was packing snacks. Hey Val. Yes, I will blame this on you. Ha ha ha. did I do? Oh. What did I do? Oh. I ejected the nose cone at last. I should have done that a lot earlier. Um. Go away, Paige. I'm busy. We are going to spacewalk. First... Do I need to transfer any stores? Yes. Little bit of mono repellent. This ship will act as a relay. Well, time to get out. What, what is going on? What is going on here? Stop that. Ah, uh, well, whatever. Let go, Val. Trust me. Uh, where's the door? I can't see, it is too dark. This is not so easy, it's dark.
And now it's too bright. What? What is going on? I didn't open the parts manager. Stop that. Just get to the ship. Hey, grab, grab, grab. Board. Why does everything have to be so difficult? What are you coming up here for? I don't want a flight report. I'm busy with the flight. Idiot. Undocking time. Haha. -ha. RCS on. SAS on. Let's get away from the ship. Whoosh. Cool. Okay. Oh, now I can't carry on with my burn. I have to make a new one. Joy. I'm just going to burn a little bit retrograde and eyeball it and then sort out the inclination and then take it from there. Well, what, what are you doing now? Point. Why is this taking you so long? Why? What are you doing? That's not how you use RCS. There's something very wrong with this game. Um, maybe it has to do with where this thing has been controlled from? I don't know. Control from here. See, it's, it's boosting front and rear. That's not how you turn a spacecraft. That just moves the spacecraft. What is going on with the controls today? I need you to turn, Val. I need you to point retrograde. Not be an idiot. Oh wait, there's something weird going on here. It's like I'm locked onto the old spacecraft. And that's a problem. I need to somehow select the other part of the spacecraft. Uh, this is a problem. Save. Problem. I'm going to try destroying this spacecraft and hope it doesn't destroy the bit that Val is on. Oh, now why can't I access the bit that Val is on? Where are you, Val? What if I just do this? Control. Wait. 
I can't find it. There's something here. Well, that's my spacecraft, but the camera's not focused on it. Well, you are in the spacecraft, right? How do I tell if Val is actually on board or not? Board. I don't know what's going on. It's like she's not in the spacecraft. EVA. Okay. Well, I'll run around a bit. Let go. And board. Oh, come on, man. Oh, this game is annoying. Board. Close. Save. Annoying. Go to the space center. Okay, tracking station. Vessels. Default name 8. Control. Ah. Save game. Very annoying. I'm going to leave the game. When you come back, I'm going to load it here. Right, we're loading back into the game. Okay, I am by Val. Check back on. Our spacecraft has disappeared without us, even though we were clinging to it. Easy file, easy. Small adjustments file. The sun is annoying. Developers, how are we supposed to do this? <laughs> Seriously. At least then let me have the Kerbal's perspective with the benefit of the visor. Okay, let's try this. Please, horrible guy, don't tell me the mission is over. Here we go. Oh, come on. What am I supposed to do with that? Get, I don't want the flight report. I don't even have Val's portrait up there. I'm going to go to map view. I'm going to see what I can do. To try to fly this thing. 
somehow. I assume RCS is still horribly broken. Yep. Horribly broken. I'm going to try a little retrograde burn, see if it turns around. Are you even burning? No, you're not. And why is there now no Metalox? I haven't used this engine yet. Ah, uh, it must have sucked it out. No, but I, I checked before I decoupled from the other one. Okay. I am now stuck. There is nothing I can do. Sorry guys, it looks like we're not going down the mohole today. Val's very relieved because now I can reset the game and she doesn't end up deserted on the planet. So this one was just too glitchy. I don't know if I try again, if it might be different. But sadly, this is the end of this run. Oh well, at least everything's back to normal. I've had too many successes lately and we don't want that kind of thing happening. Successes are abnormal and they make me feel uneasy. So all is well because Kerbals is a horrible mess just like it always should be. Uh, I was hoping this would work, but maybe some other time. Thank you for joining me on this misadventure. I hope to see you again soon. From OG and Valentina, out.